some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we follow Good Guy Audits as he attempts to harass the firefighters of New York City. What's the matter? The cops aren't enough for you anymore? You gotta go after the men who run into burning buildings and save people now? Okay, it's not my fault if you get completely owned. What's wrong with you? Mind your business. Mind your business. So, you're fascinated by fire trucks. You know what? If you had taken the proper path in life, then you could have become a firefighter if that's what you wanted to be. I mean, it's a whole lot better than going around harassing people. In this case, you actually get to save them from, from time to time. But you know what? I can't imagine you running into a burning building to save anybody. I mean, that's just not you. Sorry, you can't be filming this. You gotta go. You gotta go. Get the camera out of my face. I don't want to be filmed. Please. Please. I'm not in your way, sir. I, you need to no, I'm not. You can't have anybody over here. You gotta go over there. I'm not in your way, sir. Where's your, where's your, where's your supervisor? I want to speak to your. If you want to speak to the chief, just find the one wearing the white helmet that says chief on it. But I don't think he's gonna to want to listen to you. You're just some Karen off the streets. You back in the rig over there. You're not back to stop it. Yeah. Stop it. Yeah, you're not, I don't want to be recorded. And you're touching me. I'm not touching you. I don't you want to be recorded. You just touched me, bro. I'm not touching you. So get out of my face. Go back to work. Go back to work. I don't want to be recorded. So get out of my face. You know I'm recording. Go back to work. Have a nice night. Be dismissed. There's nothing you can do, buddy. Sorry. There's nothing you can do. Go fuck yourself. Fucking asshole. Dave, this is honestly the first time in my life that I have seen anybody so disrespect firefighters like that. I grew up around a bunch of firefighters and even became a firefighter when I came of age. And not once did I ever see anybody get disrespected because they were a firefighter. That is until now, and it is a completely disgusting display on your part, you maggot. Uh, on second thought, you are not a maggot. You don't even deserve that title. You are maggot dung. A little longer than a few minutes later. 
How you doing? Yeah, Isn't a captain available? No. A supervisor? For what reason? Is there I just want I wanted to file a complaint. Okay. You can call three one one to file a complaint. I also would like to speak to him. Maybe he can address it without having to go no, through the whole complaint he's process. Right now, he's doing paperwork right now. But you can okay. file the complaint with 311. I'd rather not. I'd rather we can, work if you can way. educate him and, you know, tell him about his behavior, then maybe if he apologizes, we can leave it at that. Rather than me going and him having a complaint on his file and stuff like that. You know I'm what I mean? I'm not sure what behavior you're talking about, but if you um, stop someone, maybe we Like touching me? Are you, are you allowed to? Test the public for no reason. I'm not informed of what happened or what you're alleging happened, so I can't give. I have it on camera. You want to see it? One way or another. I have it on camera. You want to see it? Him pushing my camera, him violating my rights. You know that's his, him violating my rights, right? Three one one. You can call yourself. I'd rather him apologize rather than going through all that. I mean, I, I will, but I need his name as well. All right. So that way I can redress my and government. And 39, ladder 16. Uh, I, need a, I need his name specifically so that I can redress my government. And you file a complaint that way. I need his name so I can file a complaint. It's public information. 311. You know that we're allowed to. You know we have the First Amendment right to redress our government, right? Oh, you frauditors are such weak, pathetic little crybabies. Oh, he touched my camera. He violated my rights. Oh, wah, 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 so he touched your camera. It's not as if he caused any physical harm to you. Get over it, you little punk. Okay, there's a police station over there if you want to escalate the situation. No, I just need his name. I, wasn't working I just today. told you that I don't want to escalate the situation. Okay. I'd rather just speak to the supervisor. If you get somebody in charge, maybe somebody right below him that I can speak to. I'm a member of the public right and I have, I have some concerns. You're not listening to anything I'm telling you. What are you the saying? engine is not in quarters right now. They're relocated to another firehouse. And the truck is in the middle of a drill right now. And the horse is not available. So can I get your so phone number? So and the captain's name? 311 is the only phone number that I'm going to give you. Because uh, that is where we file complaints with the city. You know, I think it is. I think you guys are a little bit too close to the police station. They might be rubbing off on you. Usually firefighters are the nice ones. Is the tyranny rubbing off on you guys? I guess so, right? Way. I guess I got my answer. You guys are supposed to be the, the good guys. You know, if I'm just asking for a phone number, why not give me the phone number? Or the captain's name? There's no accountability, right? He can just one. act however he acts. Three, one, one. Is there a red line? Three, there one, there one. is a red line, you're right. And you can follow what was your name? On three, one, one. What's your name? How do you say that? Three, one, one. How do you pronounce your name, sir? 311. 311 is going to tell me how to pronounce your name? Yeah, 311. You can follow How do you pronounce your name, sir? What's your name? You're a member of the public. I pay your salary. I'm asking you for your name. It's public information. In order for you to be paying a salary, you would have to pay taxes. And you are unemployed, so therefore you don't pay taxes. While he is employed, and therefore... He does pay taxes, and even if you did pay taxes, your own portion would be a very, very minuscule, tiny amount, which still doesn't give you the right to act like a complete jackass to any of these guys. One, and you can file a complaint that way. Butthead, that's his name. Buttfucker. Is that how you pronounce it? But are, you gonna a keep that, are you going to keep that in the video when you present it as Of course, but a fucker. Yeah, but a fucker. It's called so freedom of speech. To incite something right it's now. called freedom of speech. You can't okay. turn a constitution with that activity into a crime. So now you have yourself on I video. I actually pronounce it. That's how I pronounce me. it. No, so harassing you. Claiming that somebody I'm asking you for public services. You. Harassment is a repetitive it's action. street. Harassment is repetitive. If I come back here every day and I fucking threaten you, that's harassment. Me seeing you having one conversation, that's not harassment, sir. Okay. So, Three, one, one. you can ask your NYPD buddies, they'll Three, tell one, one. you. So you said that already. Easy to you didn't want to. You didn't want to pronounce your name? Three numbers. I don't know how to read that well, so to me it says butt fucker. Butter fuck. That's right, you'll get there one day. Yeah, one day. You really should learn how to read better, dude, because if you actually learn how to read at an appropriate level, you would be able to understand the Constitution and the laws a lot better than you already do, which is to say that you don't understand them at all. 
And no, watching other frauditor videos does not count as you learning the law. No, that just doesn't count. Because they're going to give you their own skewed viewpoints as well. You're dismissed. You go back to work. I thought you said you was busy. You guys are doing things. That's why your captain or supervisor can't come out to talk to me. You guys are busy? I got the house watch. I'm not busy. Okay. This is the house watch myself. You stay safe out there, okay? That's That's buttfucker. He's rude. He's rude to the public. I don't know how he saves the public's lives from fires. What if the person in the fire was recording? <laughs> You're not going to save them because they're recording. You're going to turn on code 311? Yeah, if if you go into a house that's on fire and somebody's recording, you're going to say, yo, call 311 to put out the fire. 911. Yeah. That's a number after three. If you keep counting, you'll get to nine. Yeah. Nine, oh, you're smart. Congratulations. Wow, that is just a uh, stunning image that he just put in my head. A frauditor standing in the middle of a fire recording what his eyes can see while a firefighter is asking him to leave for his own safety. And then I can imagine the frauditor saying, if I'm free to go, I'm free to stay. And then the frauditor just stays there just to uh, piss the firefighter off. Yeah, he's just going to get consumed by the flames rather than give an inch to the tyrannical firefighter. You know, I could actually see that happening with some of these idiotic frauditors. When did this guy pass away? Do you know? That's public know. information as well, right? It doesn't say. You have a nice night, buttfucker. You don't want to help me anyways. 311. Yeah, they're a little too close to the, to the NYPD precinct. The tyranny is rubbing off. You know, Dave, one of these days, you may be that dude that stands in the fire that they have to help. And if that day ever comes, I hope they at least try to save you before you make that decision to stay in the fire and film everything that you, your eyes can see before you get consumed by the flames. And just remember, they were there to help you out, but you thought they were tyrannous, so you said, screw you guys, I'm gonna go emulate myself. At any rate, I hope you enjoyed the video, thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.